Well, hey, Crossway family and friends, Pastor Dave here, excited to tell you about this upcoming Sunday's services. We're kicking off a brand new series here on August 2nd called Let's Go. We use that phrase when we're excited about what's to come, to rally together. It's like kids on the beach running toward the ocean or a team about to take the field or hikers at the trailhead ready to embark on an epic hike. We believe that God is calling us to go. He hasn't stopped moving throughout this time of quarantine. And as we prepare to regather, we want to believe and be listening for how the Lord throughout the scriptures and now is calling us to go as a church, to go and make disciples, to let go of some of the things that we've been holding on to, and to go together. The message has not changed that we are to spread and to share, but some of the ways that we might be called to go during these times are ever shifting and changing. And so we want to learn to be as responsive as we can to how the Spirit is leading and guiding us as a church to go and build the kingdom and make disciples for God's great glory and the good of the world around us. So we hope to see you on August 2nd. And there's a couple ways you can do that. You can join us at one of our locations at Milford or downtown Nashville or here at the pond at 10 o'clock or at your home at 10 a.m. as well as we'll continue our online services and you can always catch it after word on YouTube. And just as you're, if you're planning to come in person, let me just give you a heads up about some of the things that you can be expecting. Uh, you do not have to worry about registering in advance. We believe through the 50% capacity that we'll have at all of our locations that we'll have more than enough room, but it will be a first come, first serve basis at all of our campuses. And we also are going to be offering not only at 10 o'clock services, but a replay of the service at 6 o'clock that will be here at the pond and at downtown. We don't have the building available in Milford at that time. That's why it's only going to be downtown and here at the pond. And it's going to be kind of like a watch party. We'll play what happened in the morning on our big screens. It's, but it's a chance for us to worship together, to gather and hang out with others. If you're a parent, maybe one of you, and if you don't feel comfortable bringing your kids to service, maybe one of you comes in the morning and one comes at the evening. And we're doing it at 6 o'clock because that will give us plenty of time to be able to disinfect and to prepare our facility for the next uh, group of people that will be coming. So we hope and pray that we'll be able to see you on August 2nd, either in person or online. And if you are coming in person, we are strongly urging you to, to wear a mask. We want to do that out of love for our neighbors. We want to do that in obedience to our civil authorities, as Romans chapter 13 tells us. And so just as we wear masks going into stores and things like that, we encourage you to take the same posture uh, for, for the sake of others. And even if that means it's not what we would prefer. And so that's a little bit of what you can expect. You can read more details online all about our regathering guidelines. And we encourage you to do that. But until then, I'm excited for you and for our church as we learn how God is calling us to go. So let's go, church.